brand new episode of Door Slammer's Garage. We're here with my father's 1972 C10. Go and tell us a little about it. It's a half filled 5.3 with uh, stock crank, good rods and pistons, stock heads. Uh, ran a couple of 366 turbos on E85. Okay, first step uh, we got here, we got to get the drive line out. Uh, we got a new drive line to put in, and once we get that put in, we're going to go make some passes. We're going to pull these U bolts out, and we'll get the drive line pulled out. So, once Joe gets here, we can see if he built it the right size. are gone and see what we can do. So the original plan was for me to fly up to Washington and help dad out with the truck. Just good to go out and see family again and just kind of help out wherever I can. My dad knew about that and he wanted to try to get me some licensing passes. So Friday and Saturday we get there and uh, we had to work on the truck, we run the truck a little bit. And so when we uh, run the truck we figure out that the new converter that we just put in is not taking the power. We're pushing through the converter. So all we could really run was wastegate without it blowing through the converter. So instead of dad trying to run it and get a new personal best, it obviously wasn't going to take it. We ran that 1004 and that was with like the most boost my dad's ever ran. And he's ran mid nines with very low boost. So the truck just wasn't taking the power. So fast forward to Sunday, dad told me that he wanted me to drive the truck, which I will never decline that offer. You know, that truck's awesome. We went, I did all my licensing passes except for the licensing pass to get into the nines because the truck just wouldn't do it. I ran the truck strictly on wastegate and we got all the way down to 1040, I believe. And that was pretty good. And to add almost 20 pounds of boost on top of that and only gain two tenths, obviously wasn't, uh, it was obviously pushing through the converter. We were only dropping about 400 RPM when uh, Dad had the high boost. So we definitely uh, were pushing through the converter. But as you guys can see here, you can see me race the truck. It's a pretty awesome experience that my dad uh, gave me. And I'm looking forward to racing with my dad more in the future.
I don't think I got the right time for it. Yeah, that's you. Yeah, you're around 11 Yeah. You split off at the 8th. Look, he just goes past, but yeah. How'd it feel? That was awesome. <laughs> that was funny. I, I felt pretty good. Like it looked like, good. Oh my god, I'm gonna use bump box. <laughs> yeah. No, you did great. What was my reaction time? Pass looked great. Point one seven five. Not as good as I thought. <laughs> I didn't want to let off. <laughs> that was hard. <laughs> I know. I could tell. One oh four sixty. One oh four in the eighth. Same thing I was running yesterday. <laughs> you didn't let out at the half track, did you? You let it go a little bit? Yeah, he, he definitely went past it. I went past it. Yeah, that was badass. Last time I drove it, I was just so scared I didn't even lift the tap, but I shifted right at 75 this time. Cool. Looked good. That was awesome. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>